All right, traders, T.G. Watkins, it is November 6th, day after election. Trump won, and uh, with a really, really clear uh, margin of victory. And so we had a very definitive result, which, uh, gosh, that just makes things super easy. So regardless of your political leanings, it we don't have to worry about chaos and trying to decide and lawsuits and all this stuff. It was a very clear victory from what I've seen. And so... That means we can make some decisions. And with that, the SPX, the market, is just up through the roof, making new highs. Uh, from a technical standpoint, it was a nice clean bounce off of the daily 50. That worked out very well. Yes, some people, we could look at yesterday and say, hey, that was, that was the signal. It might have been, but we also still just didn't know for sure. But yeah, we can look back and say uh, that that bounce off the daily 50 was it. So and, and then along with that, we look at Tesla. Because Tesla, you got um, Elon and Trump together, and Elon's probably going to be doing some work with the government, and it's up. So again, straight through the roof. We have been in TSLL, which is the leveraged ETF of Tesla. We got into that thing all the way back here, and I think we're up 40, 41% on that name. So that's been really great. I mean, just across the board, our names are up. Uh, we got back into Irene this morning. First thing uh, we got in like $10 and it's up 10% uh, so far. So I think Bitcoin, crypto, all that is going to be doing well. I mean, take a look at Bitcoin itself. Um, hard to ignore this. And this is what I've been saying to anybody who would listen, all of our subscribers be very, very bullish on Bitcoin. And you can see it's just, it, I mean, clearly, clearly it is breaking out. And so anything Bitcoin related, uh, go for it. Hopefully Thinkorswim keeps behaving on this. Um, yeah, other than that, we're also in Shake Shack, which again, through the roof, doing very, very well. And we added a bunch of names today. We, uh, some of them have earnings tomorrow, so we'll see how that goes. But guys, I'm telling you, um, if you if you are new to me and haven't been hearing me and uh, didn't trade with me in 2020, you're missing out. Um, this not that this is going to be 2020 vibes again. That was a little extreme, but it is a very very strong market. We are in a rate cutting cycle. The president is now known either way, and the market is on fire. Things are doing well. The IWM. Let me show you that. The IWM has now broken out. You can see that here. So. Uh, right there, you know, we're on we're on track to surpass 2020 as far as the highs of the IWM. I mean, right there, we're breaking out and on our way. So small caps are going. Um, XBI, the biotech is going. Uh, KRE, this is the leverage. The uh, KRE or the regional banks, it's breaking out and on its way. Guys, uh, make sure make sure you are fully loaded and invested in this market because uh, we're we're good to go, and I want to make sure you guys know about it. So if you're out there sitting on the sidelines and wanting to make sure you tackle this, we have so many positions on that are all working. Um, Reddit is my best position. We're up 110% on that, and then we have numerous that are anywhere between 20 and 60% up. And you guys can trade options on these things if you want. I've just got more than enough things and ideas to throw at you if you're interested. So yeah, if you guys um, haven't taken the time to sign up and get into trading, and uh, now's the time, really. Now is the time to get into trading the stock market if you guys are interested. So hope you are. I'll see you in the room. Take care. Hey, TG here with Simpler Trading. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like or comment below. Also, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell so you can stay up to date with my market analysis. Or you can join my free newsletter with the link in the description. Good trading, and I'll see you at the next video.